Hey guys, in today's video, we're going to talk about how to make money. In order to make money, you need to have a skill, provide a service, or give a product. And so with one of these three things is how you're going to be able to make the money that you want. And we're going to go over each one and discuss how you can apply that in your life. So when we talk about skill, this is something that you have. So in today's examples, uh, I'll just use a car wash and then you can apply this into other industries and uh, you can be able to do this just in your own life. Um, so skill in this example would be I know how to wash cars. This is something I've learned, something I have, and this is where you can get a job because you have this skill. So someone, uh, a car wash company needs people who know how to wash cars and so they'll hire you because you have this particular skill. Uh, and so this is something it's kind of basic everyone has skills it's just learning what skills you have are good at and you can get high monetization skills uh, which people are looking for all the time uh, but in today's example it's just you know how to wash cars another way to make money is to provide a service so in this case it's like i will provide the service of washing cars so you go to someone it's like i've accumulated all the tools that you need so you don't have to buy the brushes the towels the wax, the soap, uh, and you just pay me a fee and I'll provide the service of washing your car. Or you can have a location where it's like I go and get my car washed at this location where they've gathered all the resources you would need. So you'd have the skill labor uh, to wash your car, you'd have the machines necessary. So it's saving the person customer money because I don't have to buy uh, all these tools and stuff. I can just go somewhere and use this service. So our last example is uh, providing a product. Um, so this is for this car wash example, it's I can sell you soap to wash your car. I can sell you wax so your car can look better after you wash your car. Um, by selling a product, you're not required to perform anything for them besides make the product and sell it to them. And this can be low cost or it can be high cost depending on what your product is. Uh, and so you can either have to sell high volumes to make a lot of money or a low volume to make a lot of money uh, just depending on your margin and understanding what your cost is so what's next we're going to talk about the cost of business so in the cost of business we're going to understand what our costs are within service and within the product so within the service your cost for washing a car would be how much soap am i using so how much does that soap cost per car uh, how much are the tools I'm using? So brushes, towels, buffers, whatever it may be. And then how much is the labor going to cost me? So let's say it costs me a dollar worth of soap to wash a single car. So I have to make sure that's in my cost um, for when I charge for a service. Uh, and for labor, they use 15 minutes of labor. And so what does that cost you? Uh, I pay someone $10 an hour. It's going to cost me a quarter of an hour, so $2.50. Um, and then, so you use a little bit of wax and your tools, and that varies depending on how expensive your tools are and whatnot. Uh, but those are tools that you may only have to buy once, and so it may be a high cost up front, but you could amortize it or uh, break that cost up amongst a lot of cars or uses uh, in order to calculate that cost you need for um, your end price. So let's say a total cost for me to wash a single car would be five dollars um, so understanding that cost you'll be able to recognize how much you need to charge to make sure you have a profit every time so that your your service covers that cost and so the cost of a business for a product style of business let's say i need a i sell you soap in our example um, one container of soap that i'm going to sell you cost me 250 i just need to make sure i sell that container of soap um, at more than 250 to make a profit for myself uh, and so that cost could be labor if I'm making the soap or if I'm just buying a soap from a supplier and it cost me uh, like a per pound basis like you'd see at a grocery store so per unit cost and make sure you just charge more than that so you can make that profit and so the profit of the business is how much I charge and that excess so if the cost of soap in this example is 250 I need to make sure I sell it at five dollars uh, so I get a $2.50 profit going into my pocket. And so 
that's how you can really see how you can make money in a very simple high level term and learn to apply this in different aspects of your life to where you can get the most return uh, for your time, your skills, your services you provide or the products that you provide and that you'll be able to help those around you by helping yourself as well. So as always, don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you next time.